All right, guys, welcome back to Modified Out Empire Campaign 1.3 as Sparta. This is episode 14, my lucky number. Right after 13, the unlucky number. Now, uh, we left off last time the Galatians had sallied out to fight us. Um, so we're going to take the fight. I'm unsure if we're going to be able to win it. Um, we definitely have the better line infantry but we are quite heavily outnumbered um and we don't have any cav to work with so uh, i think we can win but it's not gonna be we're gonna be easy all right little hill here i think we take the little hill <clears throat> Do all of this. Not the biggest hill in the world, but it'll do. Okay, let's do this. Uh, do I want to do that actually? Maybe take this hill here. Hmm. Decisions, decisions, decisions. Yeah, well, you know what? We'll take this hill over here. They're all of you. There we go. We'll start the battle like this. Yes. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Enemy reinforcements approaching. Let me be there. <laughs> I can't see much right now. Have a look at these uh all plates. Yeah, they're kinda cool. Take that man's name. Right. Uh I wanna see where their line is to begin with. So it looks like they're pushing their cav up right away. They are not playing around. Oh, they're over here, okay. Alright, let's try and get this line a bit more like so. We'll take you and you from the line there. You guys, here. You and you. Here. You, you and you. Over this way. As reinforcement. Oh, there we go. Found them all. Take three of you actually. Take three of you that way. You like so. You and you. A bit more. Thank you. <coughs> Move the spears here just in case the cav tries anything funny. Okay, can we sort this out a bit, guys? You. You like so. You like so. We'll leave this one in reserve. Uh, actually, swap you and you. You're my general. Apart from you and you, and we'll put everybody in phalanx. Oh, they mean, I mean, they sallied out to attack me, so. I am, I am not moving. They can come and attack me. By your command. At the double. I think Orbit if I could do this. Like so. And move these like so. <coughs> we could actually afford to pull these guys off of here. To widen the line just a touch. Advance. 
think widen line is kind of important right now. We'll leave you next to the general. Actually, we'll put you over here. We've got four here. They should definitely be able to hold. Well, not definitely be able to hold, but, you know. We'll do some work. <clears throat> Alright, come on guys. We need to hurry up and plug this gap. Our hidden units have been discovered. I hate how it calls them pikes. <laughs> it still does my absolute head in. Pike infantry ready. They're not pikes! Stop calling them pikes! <laughs> okay. Just in case they come around this way. Units has used all its Shuffle you there. There we go. Commander. One of our units has used all its ammunition. We'll get them in to help out the hoplite since they're attacking the side. Which is not ideal. But we should be able to deal with these cav. Relatively easily. Here, please. I mean, if they want to waste all their jabs on my light spearmen, I am more than okay with that. The only problem is they're not engaging and we don't have any skirmishers. So, that's a slight problem. I mean, they're just sitting back and peppering us with their... Uh, a skirmisher advantage. They don't have many skirmishers either, but still, it's not ideal. We're going to end up losing some men. Alright guys, reform that line a bit, please. Alright, you don't need to chase too much. Yeah, they're just sitting there. Using their skirmisher advantage. Move the line up. As long as we don't lose any men, I don't really need to move. I mean, they are firing face first into an absolute shield wall, so. Well, lost one there. We shouldn't lose too many. So I think I'll just stick in the in the line until maybe we start losing some. In which case I start moving. At the moment I'm okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Could be a problem. Let's catch you over here. I mean, archers, so they'll have a decent amount of uh, of ammo. Not the most, but a decent amount. But yeah, I'm quite happy to sit here until they've wasted all their ammo. I think they've killed one guy so far. Yeah, they're all just bouncing off. Kind of cool to watch, actually. It reminds me of that scene out of uh, <laughs> out of 300, where the Persians blot out the sky. Is 
We still only lost the one guy here. Oh, we lost one in this line as well. And we lost these guys to the Cavs, so that doesn't really count. Yeah, I mean, I don't really... I don't want to move and break the, the line. Since they have the massive numbers advantage, so... If they want to sit there and pepper me all day, they can, they can do that. Maybe we try and bait them into an attack with the, uh, the Spearman. We can maybe try that. This is what I'm going to go do. I'm going to go shuffle the Light Spearman down here. Yeah, our Celtic Bowmen have like no kills. Three kills so far, I think. Between them. Alright. Maybe if we poke them with enough pointy sticks, they might actually move and attack us. <coughs> Usually the AI is quite aggressive when it uh, when it's the one that initiated the attack. But clearly not. Let's see if my uh, my pointy sticks do any more damage than their pointy sticks. Nope. Not really. <laughs> One of our units has used all its ammunition. There we go. Oh, the, the cab's pushing up. I mean, if we can commit some of their cab, that would be nice. There we go. I might get him to move. Oh, oh, that Celtic Bowman has two kills. Yes, three! They're up to six kills. They're doing so well. Just keep running. Just keep running. Mm, try and get a counter charge in there. <coughs> there we go. Are you guys finally coming out to attack, or what are we doing here? Looks like they're pulling a lot of their cav around this time. Are they really, are they really not going to attack? Are they just really going to sit there all day? Lost a few out of this. I think they used a lot of their javelins over here. They lost nine men out of that part of the line. Yeah, are they using all their javs? Come on guys, just attack already. <clears throat> they have 20 ammunition as well. It's kind of actually insane. Could have a nice little envelope over here on this side. Need to be careful of that. They really don't want to move! Guys, come on, just attack! For the love of God! I really don't want to move my, uh... I really don't want to move the line. Looks like I'm gonna have to, though. Oh, now you decide to move, huh? <clears throat> huh. 
Can you just attack, man? Come on. Guys are doing my fucking pits in. I don't know what these horse things are doing. That was a really smart move, wasn't it? Finally! Dear God! It took so f it took so long. I might actually have to fast forward that in the recording. <laughs> Make sure I put everybody on guard mode before I uh, decide to attack. What is the rest of their main line doing? This is my question. Like, they've engaged three units here, but that's about it. I mean, that's not going to go too well for them. But oh well. Alright, let's try and move this line across a bit. Sorry about the boring intro, guys, uh, to the battle, but I really did not want to move that, uh, that phalanx under heavy missile attack. Did not fancy getting absolutely peppered to death. There we go. I'll we'll move it like so. <coughs> move the general up a touch. And aren't you in guard mode? You are, so why are you moving? I should try and make sure their cav does not go around the side, because if it does, we dead. This attack. <laughs> what is happening here? <laughs> no, please no. Just uh, get back in the line. Thank you. Right. Uh, what we'll do is we shall shuffle you like so, so you can attack. And we'll shuffle you up and you up like that. And then also you up. And then we'll put you out here in the wing. Okay, uh, we'll get you to attack that way. Um, Alright, so they're going to line up like that. So we'll line up like that. Like so. Like so. Have you out here. Trying to keep this line sort of semi intact while moving forward since they really are not engaging. It's very slow going. I apologize. Animal's fine there. Okay. So they've marched their. Uh, they've marched their general into this for some reason. <coughs> okay. 
And what we can do here is move you like so. Move you like so. And move you guys up. Okay. There we go. Finally, you guys move. Finally. Oh, they have overextended. They have overextended way too much. Okay. Alright, we're gonna have to try to reform the line here ish. Pull the general over here. Pull you here. Pull you guys around this way. Uh, can we please pull back? That would be nice. If we could. Hmm. Make sure everybody has an attack order. Move you up a bit further than that, guys. Come on. Up this way. Up this way. That's fine. At least we've got some sort of semblance of a line over here. Not exactly the best line in the world, but it'll do. Pack into there, please. <coughs> Pack here. Oh, our general's fine. Not being so dramatic. Our general's under attack. He's fine. What are you talking about? Okay. I think we're about ready to close this up. Get the general in here. This guy's over there, please. Yeah, uh, this could be a slight problem there. Alright, out, out, out. <laughs> I hate when the AI literally just pulls their cav through your spear line. There's literally nothing more infuriating. Okay, we need to move you up. Alright, out of phalanx. Into attack you go. Out of phalanx. Into attack. And out of phalanx, and in an attack you go. Make sure that the calf can't get round. That's fine. You guys attack them. Engage! Okay, uh, can we get you guys out of Phalanx into here, please? Thank you. Uh, we will pop off and inspire. In you go! In you go! In you go! I think we're good. Right, out of phalanx, guys, come on. Out of phalanx. Just attack. In you go. Oh, why did you stop chasing them? I don't know, keep chasing them. Into their general, please. Actually, we'll have uh, we'll have the light. Have the light hoplites chase them. You guys over here. The general's charging into spearmen again because he's big brained. Okay. You guys around here. Yeah, 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 there we go. Close the mass route. Make sure they all die. And they've done it again. <laughs> AI just pulled through an 
spear wall, because why not? Yeah, this is a problem on big units like this. We can't chase them down without Cav. They always just return. Come on, guys, chase them down. I shall have you all in guard mode. That's why. No, no, no. You can now chase to your little heart's content, guys. Chase away. We got their general yet? Nope. Our general's running around in circles, and we're chasing him in circles. I think it's just our general left, is it? Yeah, it is. Alright, we're going to continue and try and mop everything up. I'll well, mop as much up as we can. And that'll do us. differences present a challenge okay so we can do for cultural understanding inclusion oh yeah no we're going for subjugation no, 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 get out of here greek above all else all right let's uh let's finish off the galatians There we go, nice and easy. Ooh, wait. Yes, I wanted to liberate this place, didn't I? I did. Thank you, Doki. Now we have a friend. You have a friend and me. Uh, there we go. Now, just don't do declaring war on anybody, okay, guys? Glad. Glad you agree. Right, so we're moving you guys up here. Oh, yeah, what is actually... Oh, so it's right here. Just the other... Uh... Settlement. That looks like quite a cool. I uh... wonder what the battle map's like on uh, like on that the capital. We might have a little look at the battle map when we get a chance. Almost forgot about my spy. Where are you? Where are you there? Oh wow, Rome has already okay. I'm guessing Rome controls everything then. A shadow among shadows. Yes, apart from Carthage itself, Rome has absolutely everything. Well, that's uh, terrifying. Just slightly. Anywhere to spend my cash money. Nope, not really, actually. I don't really have anything to spend my money on. That's gonna give... No, we don't have the food for that. Yeah, we don't have the food for it. Uh, we would need... Side from the Egyptians, and this from the... Uh, from Pergamon. Speaking of Pergamon... What is the diplomatic relationship like? Not bad. Greetings, friend. Greetings. Yeah, they're not Do interested. Fine olives 
I don't even think if we threw all the money at them, they'd be even remotely interested. Yeah, they're not. While your rhetoric is sound, Pokemon's gonna might be a bit of trouble to confederate. Maybe we just turn around and we just smash uh, Pergamon into the ground. What do you think, guys? What's uh, what's public opinion? Do we just turn around and take Pergamon by force, or do we keep family relations going and try and uh, try and do it the uh, the easy way? Because I wasn't sure. Because we can start the campaign against the uh, Bosphorus Kingdoms quite soon. Probably another three or four turns. We can start trying to take them out. Or we could try and consolidate at home and get all of Asia Minor. That would be one, two, three, four provinces from Pergamon. And by the looks of it, yeah, quite... Quite a fair chunk of money in them as well. Hmm. I don't know, guys. Have a little, uh, have a vote down below in the comments section what you guys think we should do. Should we start our campaign against the uh, Bosphorus Kingdoms? In which case, we would be moving up the coastline here and taking their settlements this way, plus also. We'd be moving from Nicomedia up through Odessus, up this way. With the fleet as well. Or do we turn our attention back home? And, uh... Just get rid of Pergamon. Well, I'm, I'm open to both. Both ideas. We do have a little defensive alliance, so breaking that would be a bit of a... Uh... Bit of a mistake, but... I don't know. I'm open to both. Um, I think that's where we'll end today's episode, guys. Sorry that the battle took so long. Um, but yeah, I think we'll call today's episode there. And I hope to catch you all in the next one. Bye-bye.